This is the Hello World Podcast. But agriculture is really critical, no? It's physical, it's routine, but uh, it uh, provides for uh, food supply, no? Ooh. Now, for for the usual uh, corporate uh, setup, pag physical at routine ng trabaho mo, this will be the most likely targets of automation. If diba? Process organ- uh, automation. If the organization is investing to automate. Because remember... Philippines, marami din tayo yung tinatawag na MSEs, micro okay. and small enterprises. So, okay. yung mga micro and small enterprises, mm-hmm. sometimes, uh, based sa aking observations, uh, when I visit, you know, different provinces, uh, mm-hmm. to mark team up advocacy, iba pa mm-hmm. din, iba ang priority nila. Um, yes, may okay. konting technological innovations or advancement. Pero mm-hmm. ito ang focus. Um, what I notice is for most uh, MSEs, Filipino organic mm-hmm. ones, uh, ano pa rin sila, it's really more on the practical side of mm-hmm. 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 more of helping the mm-hmm. employees uh, have earn of living. Uh, mm-hmm. at conventional, traditional pa rin yung delivery of services. Mm-hmm. Because mm-hmm market pa rin nila. And again, sabi natin, consumer-driven, di ba? Ang market pa rin nila, nandun sa mga probinsya, or kung mm-hmm. sa Metro Manila, these are your, uh, siguro, uh, consumers na uh, sanay pa rin sila dun sa conventional way of... Uh, mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. So, dapat ba, if I'm doing uh, physical work and routinary work? Hi! This is Louis Banta, CEO and Chief Consultant of LJMB or Learning Just Made Better. Thanks for watching my video. To get more videos like this, click subscribe and hit the bell icon below. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, comment down below, and share this to others.